Hey everybody and welcome back here to our Journeyman series. We are back once again with Barry Town. Today's episode will see us taking on TNS in the quarterfinal of the Welsh Cup. And the second game is the big one. We will be taking on Portuguese side Braga in the second knockout round of the Europa Conference League. Both of the games today are going to be extremely tough. Uh, I think we can definitely get a result against TNS. Braga, on the other hand, is going to be an extremely tough game. We are the home team against Braga. We'll be playing at the Cardiff City Stadium. So hopefully we have plenty of fans getting behind us in both of these games. Switching over to the schedule view. We have played two games since the last time. First one was a disappointing 1-0 defeat against Kana's Key. Gave up the winner from the penalty spot in the 74th minute. Extremely disappointing against the second from bottom team in the championship conference of the split. Not happy with that. We did follow it up with a nice 4-0 victory against third place Bangor City. Francis, Osama, and Brett Jones-Williams getting the goals for us in that game. So here is a look at the league table. We are still in second place. TNS are just one result away from securing the title. So I expect them to be wrapping that up very shortly. But we will be facing off against them in the cup today. We have our strongest team out there. So let's go ahead and get this underway. We are at Jenner Park. Let's see if we can get revenge on them today. And we are underway here in the quarterfinal. Come on, Barrytown. Let's have a better performance today against TNS. That would have been promising, except Stewart was not able to keep hold of that. But the highlight goes on. Can we please win it back? Or we let them get a shot off. Thankfully, they pull it wide. That would have been the worst possible start. Another highlight, TNS on the ball. Not something I want to be seeing. Please, can we press them into a mistake here? Oh, this is dangerous. Uh-oh. It's still on. Wow. Just wide of the opening goal for TNS. And they have a corner now. Headed out by Clutton. They pick up the ball, though. It's not over yet. Gotta defend the second attack. We're not doing a good job. It is 1-0 to TNS. Ah. Uh, I don't want to see it again. Get me out of here. Ah, oh, cool. Another highlight for TNS. Guys. Good save by Wolin, but what... We are getting shredded down the left-hand side here. Oh, 2-0. Awesome. Fantastic. Couldn't it be going better? Just think what Braga will be doing to us in our next game. He has a team 20 times better than TNS. We're losing 2-0 at home in the first half. And we have a yellow card for Chris Greaves now. Ah, wonderful first half. Down by two. I just ripped the team a new one. Can we uh, put in an improved second half? We're going to go attacking because we need to. First 15 minutes hasn't produced anything, so we'll make a substitution. Rafael will come on for Stewart. Show some passion out there, guys. We do have a highlight. We need to get a goal here so we can have an opportunity to get the second one. Instead, we turn it over. We do win it back. Come on, guys. Let's go, Rafael. Whipping across. It falls to Jones Williams, and he shoots it into the side netting. Corner, please. Headed away. Not good. It's not entirely over. We don't look too convincing here. Ah, uh, it's now going to be over. Come on, guys. 
We're gonna make our second substitution. We're gonna bring on Offery for Francis. And we'll do a little switching around there. We're also gonna go very attacking, I think. Oh, wait a minute. Osama! Yes, Osama! Gets us back in the game. His 10th goal of the season. What a ball over the top by Robbie Patton. And Osama keeps his cool and gets another one past his former team. We are in this. Come on, guys. Oh, we have another highlight. Come on. Whip it in, Scott. Whip it. Ah, oh, it gets deflected. Patton picks it up. Let's recycle possession here. Go on, guys. Nice. Get there, Osama. Whipping across now. Plays it back to Davidson. One of you has to whip it in. Yes. Offery heads it over. Final substitution time. What do we want to do here? Think we will. Oh, we only have five players on the bench. Did not realize that. So. I will bring on Callum Lewis for Evan Press in midfield. We are going to go very attacking now. We have to throw everything forward. It's not looking good. Three minutes added on, and there's no highlights coming. We lose. Ah, very disappointing. So TNS probably will be doing a domestic double. Not happy with what I saw from our team there. At least Patton and Osama showed up. It's more than I can say for a lot of the other players. Ryan Stewart disappeared. 6.4. Ah, uh, well, I will bring you guys back in just a moment then when we'll take on Braga in the Europa Conference League. And we are back about to take on Sporting Club de Braga in the second knockout round of the Europa Conference League. Team news, Dominique Smith takes the place of the suspended Lewis Clutton in defense. Otherwise, it is the same team that lost the TNS. Before we jump into it, let's see where they are in their league right now. Okay, they're currently in third. Uh, still a very tough team. Let's go ahead and jump into it though. Can we pull off another miracle upset in this competition? Let's find out. All right, the teams are out. We are underway here. Biggest game in our history. Can we pull it off? First highlight of the game, it is us on the ball. Let's just not turn it over stupidly here. We're, we're scaring me, not gonna lie. Then we boot it forward. Thankfully, we do win the ball back. There we go. Come on, Stuart. Can you make something happen here on the left-hand side? He whips it in. He was looking for Asuma. But it falls to Brett Jones-Williams, and he has his shot saved. That was very good from Barry. Now we have a corner. It's whipped in by Davidson. First header is cleared out, and it comes to nothing. Oh, no. The first chance for Braga. Ah, oh, thankfully their free kick is headed just wide. Easily could have been the opener there, but we survive. And now it is us looking to create something. Francis gets tackled. Not what you want to see. This is very dangerous. It's not dealt with, and it's a goal. Ah, oh, man. We managed to get 28 minutes in before we conceded. But we didn't deal with this good enough. Greaves heads it right back into the danger zone. And he fires that in there. 1-0 to Braga. Could be 2-0 here. Offsides. He's going to look at it. But it is ruled offsides after reviewing VAR. Nearly conceded two goals in two minutes, but it could be two goals in uh, four minutes instead. We deal with that initial corner. We got to deal with them whipping it back in. Oh, Davidson nearly get it, gets it off of him. 
Well, is this guy invincible? Are you serious? Anthony McDonald rides off Davidson's tackle, and then he rides Je Jones Williams' tackle, and then he just fires that in there past Woolen. Oh dear. This is exactly what I feared was going to happen. Can we find a way to get a goal before halftime? Lenstead, we're going to concede a third, nearly. Thankfully, he does fire it wide this time. Francis picks up a yellow card now as well. Francis is really struggling. Going to set him off at halftime. Yeah, it's not, not been good. We're going to have a very uh, bad episode today, it looks like. But we'll bring on Offery for Francis. We'll put Stewart on the right-hand side and Usama on the left. And we'll see if we can uh, find anything out of this. But I think we're going to have to go attacking as well. Might as well. We have nothing else to lose at the time. And we do have an attack here. Ooh, but Osama has a bad shot in the end. Ah, uh, free kick for Braga. We did head away the initial chance, but falls right back to Braga. We do force him all the way back to the keeper, which is good. Except the highlight is still going on, which isn't good. Back to the keeper once again, if only he made a mistake there. And the highlight still rolls on, and it's back to the keeper a third time. And again, he deals with that. Osama picks the ball off of the defender. He has a shot. It's not a good one again. An opportunity here off of a corner now. Osama whips it in. Dominique Smith, oh, on the rebound, twice gets blocked. How have we not scored there? We had three opportunities, and they somehow keep it out. And then off the ensuing corner, it's headed just wide. That was our best opportunities in the game so far. And we just couldn't find a way to get it past. Come on, guys. Stewart, yes. Is he going to have a shot? Why would you do that? I'm subbing him off. He's on a 6.1 already. Rafael is going to come on for him. It is becoming apparent to me that Ryan Stewart doesn't really deal with big games. All right, our final substitution. What do we want to do? I think we will bring on... Callum Lewis for Evan Press. He's on a yellow card. A little tired. So on comes Lewis. We're going to go very attacking. There's not a lot of time left in the game. We will need a miracle if we want to pull it out. And we need to go here. Osama. Team shot straight into the hands of the keeper. Lewis picks up a yellow card as well. Five minutes after coming on it seems like. And... Looks like we are about to crash out. Our dream run is about to end here in Cardiff. And Braga are on the ball still. Can we just not concede a third one here? We definitely don't deserve that. And we do survive. Can Tyrone make something out of this? Can he get brought down in the box perhaps? No. He gets the ball taken off of him and wow. He nearly scored a goal without knowing anything about it, but it's out for a goal kick, and that is where the game comes to an end. We had plenty of opportunities, 18 shots, 10 of them on target. Unfortunately, we were not able to get it past the keeper today. Unlucky, we've had an absolutely dream run in this competition, making it all the way to the second knockout round. Absolutely proud of this team, and I think the whole entire country of Wales can be proud of little Barrytown for making it this far.
And there it is, our last bit of money for the competition. We get 387000 for playing in that second knockout round. Tremendous amount of money that we managed to get throughout our time in this competition and in Europe in general. Absolutely wonderful. But that's where we're going to end off today's episode. There's nothing left to play for in this season. So what I'll do is I will come back for the very last game of the season and we'll wrap up the season and our next episode and perhaps we'll find ourselves a new club at the end of the season. Our profile has definitely skyrocketed and there has to be teams that would want to have me on their sideline. So we'll have to wait and find out. But make sure you leave a like on this video for our European run this season did unfortunately come to an end in today's episode but I hope you guys are proud of the run we were able to make this season and if you're new around here go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell until next time it's been your Boyd 147